Poppy Sellers hail best ever year as generous Brits set to smash donations record. Volunteers say the public has been showing incredible support ahead of Remembrance Sunday this weekend. Lorry driver Barry John Smith has sold poppies for the last 25 years outside a tube station in central London. The 64-year-old takes two weeks off from work every year to sell poppies from 6 a.m. until 8 p.m. He was inspired to raise the cash by his mother-in-law Violet Brown, who was around during World War II. People are so generous in the city Barry John Smith she died 12 years ago, aged 85. Barry said, when I first started there were only paper poppies and in my first year one made about 500 pounds. Last year one raised about 17,100 pounds. People are so generous in the city. I'm hoping to raise even more this year and am well on track. Poppies are sold every year in the run-up to Armistice Day on November 11. Donations support millions of ex service personnel and their families. The first poppy appeal was held in 1921 when its creator, the Royal British Legion, was founded. It raised £106,000 to help First World War veterans find jobs and housing. Around 85 million poppies worn as a symbol of respect are now bought annually, raising about £43 million each year for charity.